Also during tonight's show, we're taking an inside look at the beef cattle industry in the great state of Florida. Cattleman to Cattleman reporter Matt Fleck takes us to an operation that has a unique focus on cattle as well as water. Let's take a look. Two Rivers Ranch sits comfortably where the Hillsboro River and Blackwater Creek converge in Florida. It's a multifaceted cow-calf operation. We're a cow-calf operation. We, um, we run Beef Master and Red Angus Bulls and Charlet for our terminal cross. The ranch has very diversified. We're a timber, citrus. They have the water over here at the springs. They're into quite a bit of other things. Well, the diversity is what keeps you sharp. You know, cattle is wonderful, citrus, you know, fiber, but all the different marketplaces are ones that keep you, you know, diverse, and you have to be. Two Rivers Ranch focuses on taking care of the land. The multi-use property supports everything from improved pastures and forested areas to a wide variety of wildlife. Well, you know, agriculturalists are really the, the first environmentalists. And, you know, if we don't take care of our ecosystems, our ecosystems will react violently and not take care of us. So we don't look at ourselves as anything other than stewards of the land. The unique climate in Central Florida means Two Rivers Ranch pays close attention to specific traits in their cattle. In Florida, you know, our resident cow herds are adapted for our environment and our soils. And so we have very high adaptability for our tropical environment. And their primary breeds are Hereford, Angus, and Brahma crosses. And then we use purebred bulls, so we have a very predictable outcome on our calves. With the grass that we have, it's, it's, as you can see, there's a lot of water. And this time of year, usually it's pretty wet. And they're rooming, the cattle on, in Florida, the rooming is really large because they have to eat a lot. To, to get the goody out of it. And when they leave here and go west, they can, they can eat a lot of grass and, and they can gain fast. The abundance of water comes from a natural spring on the property. While a portion of it is used for agricultural purposes, Two Rivers Ranch also bottles it for drinking water in Florida. We had the good fortune of having a second magnitude spring uh, located on our property that is a primary source of the Hillsborough River. And uh, in the mid to late 80s, we were approached by an international company that had a long history in, in the bottled water business about helping them develop a natural spring water brand. And we uh, bottled our first bottle of Zephyr Hills natural spring water in 1989 and presently bottle about a half a million gallons a day. Whether it's bottled spring water or beef, the consumers of those products are moving closer every year to Two Rivers Ranch as the population of Florida expands. Within a you know, 15 minute you know, circle around our ranch, there's between five and six million people. You know, so we're, we're surrounded by it. And so we really are trying to do a great job of not only just preserving you know, our property, but educating others about what it means to have a ranch, what it means for the environment, as well as just continue to educate you know, the, the young kids here in Florida. It's that dedication to the environment and the local community that's key to Two Rivers Ranch. It's something they hope people understand about Florida agriculture. The reality of it is the majority of Florida is based in agriculture. Florida's just a great agricultural place and, uh, you know, it's a kind of a unknown to a lot of people. So if people from other parts of the country uh, need to be aware that Florida is a huge agricultural engine and uh, it's a great place to be involved in agriculture. Reporting from Two Rivers Ranch near Tampa, Florida, I'm Matt Fleck for NCBA's Cattlemen to Cattlemen.